Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to welcome you back to the wonderful world of City Skylines. Mount Dante is the city, and this will be episode three. Um, uh, episode two is actually uploading onto YouTube as we record this episode. And I just thought, you know, why not try something different and not have my face in the corner of the screen? So I thought maybe we'd try to make a short video, work on one zone, and that's going to be this industry, the industrial zone that I said I was going to put over here. And on that note, we're also going to try to keep it short and sweet. So let us begin, shall we? Um, let's start with our highway access. I think I'm going to go ahead and start off with a fancy interchange, um, interchange just to um, see here because I want to do more than just industry over here but at the same time I want said industry to have, I don't want the traffic basically to become a huge issue over here. So we're going to put this real fancy inter <laughs> interstate interchange, whatever you want to call it, down. And let's see here. Let's go ahead and go curved. Um, I forgot how to. There it is. up okay flip that around okay so we got this massive interchange we're gonna have two different zones over here and actually maybe three because we do have a total of one two three four five six um, two and all uh, four, a total of three on off ramp areas. So let's let us just go ahead and see. And do I want to merge? Yeah, I want to merge into a three lane. No, let's go ahead and go six lane right here. Merge six lane of trees down one square, parallel that up with six lane going up, don't mind the noise in the background, it is just laundry being done, well, that's good. because I'm a jerk I want, we gotta have, that is not the correct Maybe if I take the time to read what I'm putting down. One way, yeah, there we go. One way to a booth. And then same thing over here. I flipped around. There we go. Now let's go ahead and let's drop a nice sized roundabout. And right here, that's not the size I wanted. I wanted a 60. There we go. Now we're going to go ahead and make this. Go ahead and go six lane. Upgrade. So I think I want to go six lane. Let's see how this turns out first of all. First and foremost, shall we? Let's see here. Two lane, two way, no. Two lane, two lane highway. Okay, here we go. Two lane highway coming in. Oh. 
two lane highway, one off. Yeah, okay. We'll just go ahead and sit and just go ahead and do our traffic manager real fast. Because you know. We'll do two lanes and then this lane will cut over here. This is really not gonna make any sense. That's my dryer. Um, I should... There's no sense in doing two lane. We're doing four lane into two lane. No, uh, let's. We should have it. This should be at least. This should be two lane. Honestly, this roundabout should be two lane. I mean that's. Yeah, that's what it should be, and then we go to traffic manager, fix this node, okay, turning straight on, we got straight on, That's what, no, we shouldn't be doing two into. And we'll go with that for now. We'll come back and fix it here later. Because right now, our primary focus is to get an industrial zone built. So, let's do just that. Let's see. Um, let's go ahead and go six lanes. Coming off of the roundabout. I mean, there we go. Go to there. Come down to about here. Let's actually upgrade. This version part down through here to one way. We'll keep it one way coming up to here. And then going all the way back down to here. Yeah. And then we'll put some little two lane roads in. Actually, no. Go ahead and make that one way as well. So this is gonna be nice. We're gonna make this a nice little farming zone over here. A nice little farmers market type deal going on. Not bad, you know, nothing too special, nothing too elaborate. Just a nice little short quick zonage and build up. We might even put some residential over here real fast. Like I said, I do want to make sure this is a short, you know, short, sweet video. I don't want to drag on forever. Let's see here. Let's go ahead and put... Sewage over here. See, um, pipe. Let's get some electric electrical over here as well. Let's see, where is that nice little? I really enjoy this asset, this solar substation. It's a thousand dollars. $16 a week or upkeep puts out 16 megawatts of power. I mean, that's you know, to me, I think that's perfect. And you know, we'll just put it here on this just right off the highway, and that way it's out of 
out of the way and it gets the job done. Okay. And let's see here. Let's go ahead and zone. Like I said, I'm going to make this a farming region over here. Sycamore Heights. Uh, I don't know about Sycamore. I guess I could close. Go ahead and close. Roundabout generator. Roundabout maker, I should say. Okay, um, we are going to go to zone. What is currently called Sycamore Heights for industry. We'll go ahead and throw down offices over here. See, they can, it being the Daisy Hospital, no wait, hold on, the Zombie Apocalypse Clinic, it being a, um, the industry, and the industry zone, let's make the hospital fit like, feel like it's in, or should be in the, in an industrial zone. I still need to find a fire department that would match, you know, that would match some of these cool assets I've got. Just can throw that down as well. Um, I feel like I'm forgetting something important. Besides press and play. Go back to the main screen here. Okay, Sycamore Heights. We're going to call you... Um... Native, native farms? No. no. Redwood farms. All right. And they're struggling for power. Oh wait, they're still struggling for power. Are they? They got the power. Oh no, they're still struggling. Let's go ahead and. Boom. Now they got power. Okay. Um, so that's not been... We haven't been playing very long. So that's good. Again, like I said, I want to keep this... I want to try to keep this short and sweet. The huge difference in... What I normally do when it comes to my City Skylines videos. Let's see here. Let us... Hmm. So we got Redwood Farms. We need residential. For that, you know, to feed them with... Let's, let's, let's go ahead and run back over here real fast. Throw down, throw down some incinerators. Oh, or a incinerator. And of course it needs water. I would put my incinerators where there's no water. Why, why would I insist on doing something silly like that? I don't know. Anyways, let's see here. Let's put those two incinerators down. That'll help with garbage. Especially when they're going to be coming over here. I'm actually curious on how this big, like, weird interchange is going to work out. So, okay, they're automatically coming off the road there. Hmm. I think... Okay, what we're going to do is we're going to speed it up. Oh, it's already maxed out. My bad. We're going to let... We're going to let the industry build up over here a little bit. Let's go back over here. And... I know I think I said I was going to make Garnett Park a commercial zone, and I said I was only going to focus on one zone in this area, this video, but I'm going to go ahead and make high density housing or residential, I should say, over here in Garnett Park. Just because 
we need residential bad. And I'm kind of piecing together a small little plan. I do mean small. Putting together a small idea. I think what I'll do is I've got I downloaded Mass Transit added that to the game and I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and do some uh, put down a bus depot ferry stop what's this? ferry depot blimp depot ooh a blimp depot would be a good idea have people going from here from that would almost be kind of weird. Having people go to work via blimp? No. I think what we'll do is we'll do it by bus, but we'll do that. We'll do that later. Right now we do have a lot of businesses failing because we don't have the residents. Or at least we didn't have the residents. Now we will have we have the population growing because I turned um what was it Garnett Park into residential? All these people are going to come over, come across the bridge here, hit that roundabout. Oh, look at the traffic coming in. You know what we need to do here? We need. Where is it? Is speed limits? No. Add priority signs. Okay. So. Stop. Give way. Is there traffic lights I can? Yes, add or remove traffic lights. I want to. We'll just add. We remove the traffic lights from there. So. It ain't going to back up on the roundabout now like it was. We're just going to free flow in. Awesome. Look at this. This is just building up so nicely. Our needs are start. They're just, they're just fixing themselves. And I kind of feel like I should go ahead and put a monument down over here in Garnet Park. Well, we still call it Garnet Park. Um, hopefully, when episode two does go up, which should be happening within the next hour. People will give me suggestions for. Oh shoot! Give me suggestions for um, names for Garnet Park and what was the other two? Uh, really? Butler Heights and yeah, Rosewood Heights. Those are the ones that we were gonna rename. But here at Garnet Park, we we deserve a monument of some sort. Uh, what's this? Statue of Wealth. You know what? Yes, let's put the Statue of Wealth right here along the river. We'll tear down someone's home just so we can celebrate wealth. And let's see here. What else we got? Friendly Neighborhood Park. Uh, that's... We almost got the lighthouse thing. Church of Ascension. Um, well, let's put the Church of Ascension right here. We got. And the tax office. This is a tax office. And we really need to do something about natural disasters. So let's throw down the seismograph right here. We'll see where that covers. That covers almost the, that covers the most entire city. Awesome. We'll throw down one over here. That way we get one that covers this area of the city. Oh, now we have monorails. What else we got? Train stations. Cable, cable cars. Hydro dam. We're not like we'll be using that on an island. Multi-platform train station. We get the bus station. Oh well. So we just got an upgrade. Awesome. We should put some buoys down for, I guess. 
possibility of a tsunami. Yeah, okay. Now, let's see here. Disaster response. We're going to throw the dis disaster response unit over here on this side of our highway system. Oops. Not what I wanted. Let's go ahead and throw some water lines over to them. And that underground. Oh, it's already got power. Never mind. Never mind. So we got disaster response. We've got seismographs. We built a part of the city for. Um, what was that I was going to say? We built up part of the city for res high density residential. Apparently, they are in desperate need of sewage. So let's go ahead and let's add to the pollution problem over here. Actually, you know what? I think we'll move all the. All of the need for pollution or sewage over here. And then we'll delete this. One right here, that way it could free up pollution in this area. Actually, we want to try to get rid of all the pollution over here. Oh shoot, I just did something really stupid, didn't I? Yeah, I don't have this water line over here connected to this water line. Now it is. Now, the sewage problem that I just created just got fixed. All right, so let's slow it down for a little bit, for a second. Take a look at what we've done so far. We've created Redwood Farms, got a nice little industrial zone here, all farming land, um, we'll just gonna pause for a second. We've got our disaster response unit in place, we built you know, the Plaza of Wealth, or Statue of Wealth, and turned Garnet Park into a, basically, a high density residential zone. Actually, speaking of which, the budget or the taxes, where is it? Budget taxes. Yeah, we need to up our resident our taxes for the high density stuff. I didn't think of this just just now. That's gonna help us on our budget. But anyways. We threw down a church, tax office. Still don't know what we're gonna do over this way. Hopefully something epic. But for right now, since we're doing, I wanted to do something short, sweet, and keep it kind of entertaining. But at the same time, you know, not long and boring. I want to go ahead and call an episode, call the episode over now. We're just going to go ahead and go to cinematic mode. And if you enjoyed the video, I would really like it if you hit like, shared, and subscribed. Um, don't remember, don't, don't remember, don't forget, um, those three sections, Garnett Park, and Butler Heights, and whatever the third one was, I, that's how unforgivable the name is, um, you know, suggestions in the comments for new district names, but, uh, right now, let's just enjoy, enjoy the city that we have so far. note I think we're just gonna go ahead and we're gonna call it quits thank you again for watching I'm going to try to do more short videos like this in the future um, have a good evening and I'll see you in the next future I mean in the, in the next future in the next video thanks and good night